And now here are the thoughts for the week of Thanksgiving. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him, and bless his name. My heart is filled with gratitude. In the expression of thanksgiving, I will receive a great blessing. Gratitude opens the door to a greater blessing. For all the blessings of life, O oh God, make me truly thankful. With the power of gratitude actuating my life, no good thing can be denied. With a heart overflowing with gratitude, I enter into the blessings of life. And now, Dr. Lyle will give us our meditation for this morning. Let's have a moment of silence before we begin. Now all the thoughts and cares of the day, the week, dissipate. Allow yourself to become composed. We place our feet firmly on the floor, <clears throat> our hands palm down in our lap. We sit with our spine erect and we go within to the third eye area. Lord Jesus, take each of us by the hand. Lead us gently up the little path, through the narrow gate, through the Holy of Holies, into the kingdom of God where all is righteousness. Here each of us is one with the Father. We thank thee, Father, that thou hast heard us, thou hearest us always. We're all mindful at this time of the year that it is Thanksgiving. And it is fitting that this morning we sit and spend time being thankful. So take this moment and be thankful for all the love that you have in your life. For the people that you care about your family, your friends, your loved ones. Be thankful for those that you work with. Be thankful for the animals in your life. Whether domestic or otherwise. Be thankful for the peace that you enjoy each day, morning and evening. Be grateful for the harmony of life. Be grateful for that which you contribute to it. And be grateful for that which you receive from it.
Each of you is abundantly wealthy in your life. Be grateful for that wealth. Be grateful for that abundance. Be grateful for the celebrations of your life. and the celebrations of others. And we thank thee, Lord Jesus, for leading us in the way of the truth that frees, the perfect love that casteth out fear, the peace which passes all understanding, and the way of eternal life. Amen. And now join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Let us not be led into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever. Amen.